evaluating at this moment if we want to cross this right now. I'm here with Ed Shaheen. Final uh, moments. Final moments. <laughs> and we are evaluating if we should cross this area. We just came from this side of the reef. We want to continue, but there is a challenge. And the challenge is, and the challenge is about 50 to 100 feet of this. Should we do it? Wanna, is the question. I want to do that. We are evaluating Eddie saying that we can go up. Can we go up? Yeah, Ed. You, you, you drink too much coffee this morning. Yeah. Mr. Structural Engineer, <laughs> what is the final decision here? Let's go back. <laughs> <laughs> the challenge, I think the ocean won this one. Yeah, let's go back, respect ourselves and, you know, I think that is yeah. even over now. I, I think if we slip, I think the ocean will take us in in a hurry. This is how it looks right now. All right. Okay. So we flew my drone. Oh. And uh, Some of fish, you know. and we, unfortunately, we lost it on the water. The ocean cleaned it. So we as good. By hook or a crook, we're gonna find it. We are expeditioners, and we are on a quest to see if we can locate the drone on the other side, coming from the other side of where we were, and that's way over there where we probably think that we can access where the drone is right now. I'm here with my good friend and uh, adventurous, adventurous Ed Shaheen, Ed Shaheen <laughs> to start this quest going right now with a white point in the city of San Pedro. Uh, just wait for the next follow-up. Hopefully we don't have to call 911 to uh, get be rescued. All right, we're recording. We went around the first time to avoid this. We launched the drone to figure out what was on the other side because we saw that this was too dangerous. And we went from the other side from White Point and we just crossed it. So what do you think about that, Ed? Our reference is that tennis ball that we have right here that I had in my hand. It's God's will, David. Huh? It's God's will. It is. Maybe we won't be able to find the drone yeah, that thing. Yeah, this is where we took the picture, right here at the top. And I was thinking of going like this, we're gonna run. So and this is the place where we try to avoid because it looks kind of dangerous. And we just crossed it coming from the other end. So it should be here. From the other side. So it should be, the drone should be pretty much on that side, in that area, if it was washed by the ocean. So we're gonna take a look one, one more time with an operation rescue right now. I'll keep you updated. We believe the tide has gone down a little bit. That's why we're able to do this right now. All the rocks are really slippery. And we see if we're lucky enough to locate the drone. The same place that we saw that it was difficult to cross, we crossed it twice now. When you have a mission in mind and there is a purpose, I think anything can be possible. 
search and rescue is about to be called off. Goodbye, little so, drone. Uh, Mara, uh, do you see all this payload? Yes, we see it. I'm sure it is stuck over here. Probably. We don't have a scuba diving gear to... We need another drone. We need another <laughs> drone to search for the drone. Definitely. Search and rescue mission has been called off. It's a failure. We now pronounce this drone disappeared and missing in action.